Perhaps we listen for his voice. Perhaps we wait upon him to tell us what to do, what to think, where to go, how to behave. Here's a question for you. If the Bible is totally sufficient, do we need further instructions? If a parent was going to leave the family for a season and left instructions on how to live, handed it to the eldest child and said, here are all of the instructions that you need. You do not need any more information from me for this household to run and for you to be safe. But I'm going to call you, but you're not going to know for sure if it's me. You might recognize my voice. You might not. And you might not be sure the information that I'm giving to you is actually accurate. So test it out with the note that I am leaving with you. You'd say, well, well that would mean that the note isn't exactly sufficient, is it? And yet so often, rather than relying on the Bible and the Bible alone for sanctification, we go sniffing for virtually every other means of sanctification than the one ordained means that God has provided, the Bible. Good evening, my fellow totally depraved Americans.